for Civic Center TV, I'm Emmy Lucas at the Family Aquatic Center in West Bloomfield, where they are wrapping up yet another successful season. And today, taking a dip in the pool? Well, that was for the dogs. <coughs> it was the calm before the storm. <coughs> Just beyond the gates of the Aquatic Center, dogs and their owners anxiously awaited the opportunity to make a splash. Who did you bring here today? Chauncey. Now, has Chauncey ever been in the pool before? He has. He's not that crazy about it. The first year when he was a puppy, he liked the water, and then ever since then, he really doesn't like it. But he comes here to play with all his, uh, his buddies from the, the dog park. Hosted by the West Bloomfield Parks and Rec, this dog's only swim event has been wrapping up the summer season for several years now. We've been doing this for about eight years, um, and it's just great. It's our very last event that we do here at the pool. As soon as we let the dogs out onto the pool deck, it'll be chaos. <laughs> Separated by weight class, the smallest group filed in first for half an hour of precious pool time. Make sure you take the dogs off the leashes, please. And with that came the storm. The dogs were let loose. <laughs> this is Bingley. She just jumped right in. She was the first one in. <laughs> Nothing scares this puppy. And while some couldn't wait to jump in, <laughs> others, like Chauncey, were just there for the treats. And just like kids, you can imagine accidents do happen. But since the pool is already closed to the public, there is no need to worry about whatever may be left behind. And we encourage people to make sure that their dogs go before they get in the water. So just like kids, sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. And while Civic Center TV was there, it seemed to work. No visible crimes were committed, at least not in the pool. Oh, oh yeah, you're nice and wet. For the rest of the morning, Dogs and owners took advantage of the cool escape that the pool offered as the late summer sun shone down on West Bloomfield. People just really enjoy spending time with their dogs and it just gives them another way to spend time with them. And before the last dog could shake off, Parks and Rec was already busy planning for next year's event. That we are looking, always looking for sponsors for this event. Um, we're going to go back to doing our pet expo, our dog expo, out on the pool deck next year. So if there's any dog grooming companies or anything like that that's interested in, in possibly sponsoring um, next year, just give us a call. Although the Aquatic Center is now closed, there are still many amenities and activities you can enjoy in the West Bloomfield community. To find out what you can participate in, pick up the latest copy of the Pathways magazine put out by the West Bloomfield Parks and Rec. For Civic Center TV, I'm Emmy Lucas. You're watching Civic Center TV, television that's close to home.